Tell me about us, have you seen her? It was about five minutes ago When I seen the hottest chick that a young and never seen before I say, hello, tell the girls I wanna meet her On second thought, that ain't the way to go I gotta give a game proper Spit it so she get it, cause she is, I gotta stop her Um, hi <laughs> Today, we're gonna be turning ourselves into innocent little flowers Pretending like I'm innocent, girl, if you knew <laughs> Seriously though, I'm really into the cute little innocent aesthetic at the moment. I'm into two aesthetics. The one from my last video, which is like chic, looks like I just stepped off the runway model off duty. And also the innocent pure flower. Never seen a penis in my life. I'm gonna use my VDL primer today. Um, my skin has been acting so whack at the mo Oh my God, am I running out of this? Oh my God, no. No! I'm gonna mix this with my Too Faced primer. My skin has been playing me lately, so I don't know what's going on, guys. Um, to be honest, it's probably my diet and all the fried chicken I've been eating. Ever since my fried chicken mukbang, I have not stopped eating that chicken. I bought another chicken combo last night, and God, it was so good. It's because it's just me that's eating it. I live with my roommate, but she's a vegetarian, so obviously she's not going to be eating fried chicken. Um, so I just buy this giant box of fried chicken with like t like 20 pieces. There's no way in hell I could eat the whole thing at once. So the chicken usually lasts me like a week. And then I just buy more chicken, girl. It's just a nasty cycle. And it's so funny because I grew up my whole life thinking that I didn't really like fried chicken, but it's just I don't like American fried chicken. Korean fried chicken is delicious. I'm running out of my NARS foundation because this is like my 800th bottle and I use it every day. Um, but I'm gonna do like two squirts. I don't want this to be too heavy because we are going for like that kind of youthful innocence today. Um, then I'm gonna grab my nose concealer and I'm going to add a little bit more concealer than usual because for some reason these dark circles girl they will not go away so I've been watching this show called you and it's literally my favorite show now um, it's only four episodes in so I've seen all four episodes when the first episode came out I watched it three times because I have a problem. So I had seen the preview for you. Um, it stars Penn Badgley and Shay Mitchell. So I had seen the preview for it like months ago, like before the summer. I thought this looks like such a cool show and it's based off a book. So I pretty much picked up the book right away. I read the book so fast because it was so amazing. It's so good, guys. I mean, I feel like it might be an acquired taste because if you're not into like really sick, disgusting things like I am, you might not like it. It's so funny because I will post the sweetest, nicest parts of the show on my Instagram story and the people will DM me being like, what show is this? Oh my God, I really love romances. And I'll be like, girl, I don't know how to break this to you, but uh, <laughs> this ain't a romance, girl. <laughs> oh no. So basically, the show is about this guy who becomes obsessed with this girl to the point where he starts stalking her, like finds out where she lives, watches her in her apartment, breaks into her apartment, like stalk her. And basically he uses all the information that he gets about her to make her fall in love with him. Of course there's fun killing and all that stuff. <laughs> Murder, so fun. But yeah, that's what the uh, story's about. The book is obviously way sicker. You could put anything in a book. Like books have no censorship, whereas TV, you know, things are like, you gotta tone things down and make it a lot more censored. Like in theory, a 12 year old could go to the bookstore and pick up Fifty Shades of Grey and start reading it. Like, I'm sure there are 12 year olds that have read Fifty Shades of Grey. But I love anything that has to do with psychopaths, serial killers, all that kind of stuff. That is my jam, oh my God. The book is like so much worse and by worse, I mean better. <laughs> because the book is like from his sick perspective. Like the first few pages, I was just like, 
disgusting. So if you like that kind of stuff, definitely watch this show. It's so good. Next, I'm going to contour. Uh, I'm gonna take my NYX palette as usual. Take this dark color right here on a big floof. And I always start with the jawline because that's where I want the most product. I'm gonna attempt to do like a more rounded jawline today just because it is like more youthful. And then I take my brush and I kind of press it in where my cheekbone is and then just brush downward. I'm gonna be taking this color from 3 C. it's called Rose Beige and using that as my blush. It's a very light color so I, I do like go ham with it. And then for eyeshadow, I'm going to take my Urban Decay Naked Basics palette and I'm going to go in with this color right here to start. Um, it's called Faith. Just going to use this as our base color. And then I'm going to take this color, what is this called? This color right here called Lockout and concentrate that closer to the lash line. Um, for a little sparkle in my eyes, I'm taking, you know what this is, it is the Estila Glitter in Kitten Karma. And I'm just gonna put a little bit, like, right on top of the lid. And taking an even tinier brush. And boop, 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 boop. And I'm gonna put that underneath. Now I'm going to take my MAC Chestnut Liner, which is, yes, a lip pencil. Don't judge me. I'm using it as eyeliner today, okay? I'm going to jump straight into lipstick. We're going to use Fenty's Single today. Um, I'm just going to put a little bit in the middle and then start blending it out. And I'm going to take the same color on my finger and start using it as our blush. I'm keeping it right on the apples of the cheeks. Now I'm going to go back to the eyes. I'm just all over the place today. And I'm going to take my eyelash color. This is one from Shimura. I have been growing out my lashes. I haven't really been wearing false lashes lately. And it really has been paying off. I actually have lashes now. And I recently started using a lash growth serum. So I've been using it for like maybe like the past four or five days or so. So I'm hoping that maybe by the end of this month, I'll see a big difference in my lashes. I'm going to recurl these. The bad Gal Bang is my favorite mascara right now. I feel like it's a perfect combination between having like dramatic lashes and having really natural ones. It also doesn't clump up like ever. So I'm gonna take this, uh, the Brow Contour Pro from Benefit. This is a new product that they have. They recently sent this to me and I have never tried before, so I wanna try it out. It comes with four different shades and you can like click them like the, like the, like that. They, you, 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 just, you, just, uh, you just click it like that. Kind of like those pencils I used to have in like elementary school. So it comes with a lighter shade, a deeper shade, a definer, and a highlighter. So I'm gonna start with the lighter shade. My eyebrows don't really need much because I just got them done. The only thing I don't like about this is that there's no spoolie. So I'm really used to like filling in and then spoolie, filling in, spoolie. Now I have to find a spoolie. Next, I wanna, I'm want i going to grab some more Kit and Karma, and I'm going to put that in my inner corners. Now I'm going to take Ashton from Anastasia, and I'm going to add it to the center. And I'm also going to add a little bit of highlighter. I'm going to take Light Skipade from MAC, which is literally like a white highlighter. So I just had the brilliant or terrible, not sure, idea to make my eyebrows straighter. I'm going to take the Brow Contour Pro and I'm gonna use the highlight shade and I'm just gonna like go over my eyebrow and see if that will make my eyebrow look, look straighter because the more straight your eyebrows are, the more innocent you'll look. That's the trick, ladies. Scamming with Darcy.
that look straighter? It probably would have been easier to use concealer, but here we are. Bitch, I'm adorable. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, definitely give it a big thumbs up for me. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I love you so, 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 so much. Bye. <laughs> Woo! See you later, guys. Tell me about us, have you seen the It was about five minutes ago When I seen the hottest chick that a young and never seen before I say hello, tell the girls I wanna meet up On second thought that ain't the way to go I gotta give a game proper, spit it so she get it Cause she is, I gotta stop